Hello friends, in this uh, video tutorial, we are going to see how we can host a domain name in AA panel. So, and in this uh, tutorial, I will be covering everything like how to set up DNS, uh, our own name server, everything. <clears throat> so, first we need to do is we need to log in into our AA panel control panel as admin and then click website. okay and as you can see i have no website added this is a fresh installed a panel okay so let's add a website click this button add site and here i'm going to use one of my ideal domain name as so this so you need to add your domain name here this is the banga d a r b h a n g a dot net and uh, uh, and we will leave rest uh, at default uh, we don't need an if you need FTP account you can set up here we don't need database at this time select PSP version I'm selecting 7.4 and keep the site active default and uh, let's leave this SSL add SSL and everything let's keep default everything we will be adding the ssl uh, later on so for now just click submit okay so we have added the and now if you click this reload this website tabunga.net it will still not load because we have not configured dns so you have two options you can either use a third party dns service or you can set up your own dns uh, server on this uh, on this server so there are many third party uh, free dns provider and one of the famous is cloudflare cloud player and you can you can visit their website and sign up and add your website and they have a free plans and this is quite amazing but in this video i will be showing how you can set up your own name server and dns everything so click app store and the app store search for dns okay here you'll find this uh, um, this d dns or uh, this dns manager will your own dns servers based on pdns this so just click install of dns manager and confirm and this will take few minutes as you can see here it's installing and it is still installing this will take few minutes okay so we have installed dns manager this dns manager 3.4 now click settings here and then click add domain so my domain was funga.net and into the IP of this VPS that is my my IP here you can see 45.45.219.169 just copy and paste like this and then SOA so type ns one dot thefunga.net so we'll simply copy from here and for name server forms just type ns1 dot dot net for name server 2 make it ns2 dot dot net and click confirm okay <clears throat> now for default name server you can again 
set it as uh, ns1.darbhanga.net and for name server to ns2.darbhanga.net click save okay now uh, go to your website and let me just refresh my website once again and this will still not load because now we need to configure our name server in domain control panel so login into your domain control panel uh, you may have your domain at godaddy i have my domain here so first we need to create child name server so create child name server and my is in ns1 .net, okay and the ip should be your ip of the pps so your server so SPPS has the IP of 45 dot and click save and now create another name server with same IP and ms2 dot net and click save okay now we will set change the name server of this domain to our newly created so this is ns1 ns1 dot net and we have ns2 net and click update name server so that's all and let me now refresh my website dharunga.net and this says welcome to nginx this is the default uh, uh, page and so we have successfully uh, create created a domain name and we are hosting here so now let's uh, change this domain default home page so go to the file manager of this .net. okay here you can find uh, index.html so click edit double click to edit and this is uh, the default page so i'm going to simply remove the default tags and i'm going to add something my new website on a panel that's it so i am save this one save saved now I defense our website you can see my new website on a panel so thank you guys this is how you can add new website now for second domain you can follow the same steps